Now, here's your Storm Tracker weather forecast with Chief Forecaster Bob McGuire. Good evening, everybody. Hope you're having a happy new year. We're going to start off tonight with the middle of the trifecta. Well, we're talking about super moons. Take a look at this picture here. Leon Jensen got this picture of the moon rising over the McCullough Peaks over there in Wyoming. Cool looking shot there. And of course, the trifecta, of course, we have a super moon today. We got another one at the end of the month, which makes it a blue moon. Plus, we had a super moon last month in December. So it's just been kind of wild. And look at this picture. Almost looks like a crystal ball. It's a frozen bubble. Gloria O's Alwyn got this shot. And you can see the sun kind of peeking through the bubble there. Just a cool looking picture. Thanks, Gloria. Here's the way it looks in Billings right now. Currently, we do have two degrees with mostly clear skies, but look at that. Southwesterly wind at 26 miles per hour. We're finally getting the Chinook winds. They're coming down the eastern slopes of the divide, and it's going to start pushing some of this cold air out. Unfortunately, it's doing it at a wind chill factor that feels like 22 below zero. Two degrees has been our high temperature. The current temperature is also our high for the day. We started at 12 below. Here's your normal high, 35. The record 60 back in 1997. Record low is 25 below. Back in 1941 in precipitation, nothing new to add to the total today or this month or the year because we're just starting it out. So we're a little bit behind in all three categories. But you'll notice here we are pretty chilly. Look at over there. These are current temperatures. 31 below zero at Jordan. Mile City 24 below 24. 8 below Glasgow, not wind chill factors, actual ambient air temperatures. We're actually above zero over here at uh, Billings and at uh, Livingston, 8 degrees there, 3 over at Dillon. Western part of the mountains, we're seeing temperatures there into the 13 or 11 degrees, depending on where you're at, Kalispell 11, uh, Missoula about 13 degrees. And as you can see, winds are still kind of breezy here in Billings, about 26 miles per hour. What does that do for our wind chill factor? Well, it makes us feel like 22 below. Feels like 43 below over a mile city, 42 at Glendive. Feels like 47 below at Glasgow right now. Just very chilly. You don't want to get cut out in that stuff. And because of that, we still have this wind chill advisory till tomorrow. Looking for 20 to 40 below zero wind chills there. Also, uh, out here on the western slopes of the divide, we're looking at a winter weather advisory, generally for blowing snow until 11 a.m. Plus, we have the ground blizzard out there by Glacier National Park. Winds to 45 miles per hour. It's closing roads there. Also, here at the Crazy Mountains and also on the eastern slopes, of the Beartooths will have that uh, winter weather advisory for blowing snow until 4 p.m. on Tuesday. And so that's what's working. You can generally partly cloudy skies across much of the state. Actually, not you look at it, it doesn't look that bad. It just is cold. We've got all this cold air funneling its way down into the central plains and the rest of the Midwest. New ridge of high pressure here is going to slowly start working its way into our region. As it does so, we got high pressure moving in and it's going to let all that cold air, Arctic air, kind of drain away. 6 a.m., you'll notice the high pressure is pushing air into the Billings area. We'll actually warm up and get above zero and stay above zero. Stay that way throughout most of Wednesday and most of that cold air continues to slide into the rest of the uh, high plains and also uh, into the Midwest. So we're looking at sunny skies moving in by midweek. After that tonight though, very cold. Look at these. These are actual temperatures tonight. We'll cool back down to the single digits above and below zero out west. Back here in the east, generally below zero. Billings four below zero, but I think we've already been there tonight. I think we've turned a corner. We're starting to warm back up again. And so here's what you'll see tomorrow getting back up into the mid 20s across eastern Montana. Uh, brought us maybe 32 degrees in the far west, also into the 20s out there. Mostly sunny skies will rule. And uh, then tonight at the midnight, five below zero, maybe four above zero by 6 a.m., maybe by 23 degrees by 6 p.m. with generally clear skies. Next seven days, generally going to be pretty nice. Mostly sunny skies, 29 on Tuesday. Look for a lot of blowing snow that day. And then to the 30s and 40s, a chance of rain on Saturday, mixing with snow, and then back to the 30s by Sunday and Monday. Let's go back to Dustin.